Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'll be showing you what's inside of Cassis and Uranus loot pools and showing you how their drops work. I will be putting up images of the code dump from the game in order to provide you proof for everything as I used BLCMM to display these as normal game consoles too complicated to read from and has the same color for everything. We can start by looking into what Uranus drops. He has 10 loot pools connected to him. Six of them are named Shower Loot Boss, and one of them is for a guaranteed legendary and or pearl. These six loot pools also have the chance to drop three legendary each at 3%, and then since there are six of them connected, you have 18 chances of getting a legendary from Uranus at 3% chance each. I will display a picture of what's included inside the loot pool that is linked, and uh, six times that is. Then he has the 10% chance for the electrical chair and 20% for the skins, and they do not change the higher mode you go in, CBHM and EBHM. Then we move on to Cassus, and he is an exact copy of Uranus, with one exception. He has five shower loot boss loot pools connected to him. That means he has less chances to drop a legendary than Uranus, since he only has 15 chances to drop a legendary versus 18. And the chance to get his grenade goes up in TVHM at above at 40% instead of 20%. In conclusion, Uranus is probably the best farm in the game for any legendary or pearl. He's basically a giant loot midget, from what we can tell. You can often score 5 or even 6 legendaries out of them, and I'm sure it'll be fun for someone to try to get 7 or even 8 legendaries out of them to see how lucky they can be. I hope you guys found this video useful, leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys for watching.